drove my grandfather grocery shopping. He was amazing. My grandfather could pick watermelons by flicking them. It's an amazing technique. <laughs> We'd be at the grocery store, he'd be like this. No. No. Yes. I'm like, how do you know? He's like, don't worry, young Jedi. Pack it up, let's go. We'd go home, open it up, sweetest watermelon in the world. But I never learned. So I just go to Ralph's now and pretend, make sure people are watching. I'm like, hey, how you doing? What's going on? Yeah, watch this. No. I don't think so. Yes. Take it home, open it up, run. Try and return it. They're like, you can't return an open watermelon, sir. I'm like, but I flicked it. It didn't work. What am I supposed to do? Grandpa was amazing. Grandpa lived till he was 98 or 100. We don't know. We don't know how old he was because he came over when he was in his 80s. And when you come to America in your 80s, you lose your birth certificate, you lose your name, you lose your memories. Everything was gone. So every once in a while, when it was someone else's birthday, we just throw him in the mix. He had like four birthdays a year. He'd be like, I'm aging really fast this year. What? I could have sworn I was 90 earlier. I'm 94 already. And it's only March. How does that happen? <laughs>